All the way back in 1979, Ridley Scott's Alien stood out for its simplicity, essentially being a slasher movie in space. But this simplicity eroded as the franchise expanded, with most subsequent films becoming lost in philosophical musings and in-universe lore, particularly Scott's own prequels Prometheus and Alien Covenant. Director and co-writer Fede Alvarez seems to have recognised this issue and, with Alien Romulus, has now returned the franchise to its simplistic roots. Set between the first two films, the story follows a young crew trapped on a desolate deep space mining colony. Among them, Kaylee Spaney's Rain and her malfunctioning android brother Andy, played by David Johnson, who discover an abandoned space station that may hold the key to escaping their bleak existence. But as you might expect from an alien film, extraterrestrial horrors await. Alien Romulus succeeds in stripping back the unnecessary complexity and focusing instead on suspense and simplicity, much like the original film, with Alvarez and co-writer Rodo Sayagues quickly establishing the stakes in addition to making the characters relatable and their peril understandable, while the director crafts a number of suspenseful set pieces that harken back to his previous horror works such as Don't Breathe, all of which are brought to life with impressive production and sound design, along with great practical effects that stand out in today's CG-heavy environment. The film's simplicity is its greatest strength, emphasising intensity and terror while lightly hinting at larger forces without delving too deep into backstory. And as a result, Alien Romulus is perhaps the most frightening entry since the original, as Alvarez effectively creates growing suspense as the young protagonists face one horrifying encounter after another, with the filmmaker also exploring their internal fears of living repetitive, overworked lives like their parents once did. However, the film seriously stumbles when it indulges in fan service, to where it occasionally feels like a greatest hits compilation with repurposed lines and familiar soundtrack beats. The low point being a major appearance by a CG rendered legacy character as played by someone who's long since passed away, which feels not only out of place but wildly unnecessary, detracting from the film's otherwise strong use of practical effects. Despite these flaws, Alien Romulus is a suspenseful, refreshingly simplistic four-star return to the franchise's roots, with director Fede Alvarez delivering the kind of intense sci-fi horror that made the original Alien a classic. Visit the Film Feeder website to read my more detailed review, but for now, thanks for watching, please like and subscribe for more reviews, and I'll see you next time.